Pastor George Borkard, and this is another Higher Things video. Sure, God desires to mercy you, not for you to sacrifice for Him. That's the subject of today's Higher Things video. Short. Sure. Like, subscribe, ring the bell, get the app, donate. If you like what we're doing in Higher Things, like our videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, ring the bell for notifications, get the app. It's on all the major platforms, iTunes, Apple TV, Google Play, Amazon, Roku. Donate. Your tax-deductible gift keeps higher things, which is the best youth organization in the business, of passing on the faith to the next generation. That's all we do. That's all we're about, is passing the faith to the next generation. And our kids need this gospel today. Give today. Today is St. Matthew's Day. Uh, the 21st of September, Matthew, the tax collector, called by Jesus. He passed his tax collector booth and said, follow me. And Matthew left all he had, his riches and everything, and followed him. Tax collectors were the filth of the ancient world. Um, imagine that you had to pay someone. Like, you had to pay them your taxes or else. Most of our taxes get taken out. Imagine how you would feel about the person who you had to write the check to. And then understand that they had the biggest house in the block because they basically would charge you more for their taxes and then take your taxes and then take their cut out of it. They're filth. And really, who wants to have an IRS agent over to the house? Well, Jesus, after he calls Matthew, also known as Levi in the Gospels, goes to his house. And when he's there at the house of the tax collector, Matthew, the Pharisees ask the question, and here it is in Matthew chapter 9, why does your teacher eat with sinners and tax collectors? And hearing them, Jesus said, it is not the strong who need a doctor, but those having kakos um, uh, sicknesses or those having bad stuff. Um, go and learn what this means. I desire mercy and not sacrifice, for I've not come to call the righteous, but the amartolos, the sinners. What comfort for Matthew, first and foremost, a sinner. Jesus came to call sinners. It's not those who are strong. It's not those who have their stuff together. It's not those who are super Christians who need Jesus. It's the rest of us. Those who can't get by on their own. Those who don't do what they should do and do do what they shouldn't do. Those who look at their lives and go, I just don't measure up. I'm just not enough. Those people. Sinners, they need the doctor. They need the good physician. You see, God desires to mercy you, not for you to sacrifice. God desires for his son to die for you, to save you, not for you to save yourself by dying for God. God has made a decision for you. He has called you by the gospel. He has lightened you with his gift. He doesn't need you doing anything for him. He's already done everything in the sending of his son. He wants to save. He wants to mercy. He wants you. And whether you're a tax collector, a pastor, or a sinner like me, the only hope that you have is not that your pastoring will save you. It's not that your um, change of life will save you. It's that Christ lived his life for you and died the death you deserve. And by his death and resurrection, even people the likes of you and me are saved. If Jesus saves Matthew, then we have hope and we have mercy. And we have love from God to us in Jesus. And no matter what else is wrong with you, no matter what else is true of you, this is true. God desires to mercy you. He desires to save you. Pray with me. 
O Son of God, O blessed Savior Jesus Christ, you called Matthew the tax collector to be evangelist and, God, and apostle. Through his faithful and inspired witness, grant that we may also follow you, leaving behind all covetous desires and love for riches. For you live and reign with the Father and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. A blessed sinner apostle day. God has saved people the likes of Matthew. He saved the people the likes of me. He's got you too. He desires to mercy you. I'm Pastor George Barkhart, and a sleeping Thor, and this has been another Higher Things video short.